Hey what's up guys, OSG here and I know it's been a while but there has been two reasons for that. One is that I have had a wisdom tooth removed which resulted in an infection in my jaw which thanks to antibiotics has now subsided. The other reason is what we're going to talk about today. About 6 months ago I had an idea to make a front end for Winvice. Kind of like what the Amiga FSUAE is to WinUAE. Anyway, off I went and what started out as proof of concept has now reached the beta stage. And we have version 1 of OSG Vice. Emulation on the C64 is great and WinVice is definitely the best emulator out there for the Commodore 64, but there has always been a bit of fiddling about to find games using the auto start function etc. This front end takes all that away. I have made this first version a collection of the A to Z of Commodore 64 hidden gems, which contains all the games that I had in my recent series. I have made 260 20 second video snaps for each game, and each game when selected from a list displays box art, video and game info in the application. The application is made in Visual Studio, using C Sharp as a coding language. It's a basic Windows form application that is made up of two forms laid so I can get the transparent bezel to work. So be warned, if you're going to try and screen capture this through Window, it won't have the bezel or Commodore logo on. Anyway, as you can see I have been really busy getting this ready. And after some initial testing from a couple of my mates, I find out a few problems like accents not showing up in the game info etc. I have also added a number of features as requested, such as auto joystick set to part 2. This is actually now a checkbox, and if unchecked, uses a predefined key set for those not using a controller. And I have added a checkbox to run in full screen or window mode too. The search function will search on a contains basis, i.e. if you type in world you will get another world, world sports etc. The games list is populated by parsing an XML file that I have populated with over 260 game names. This is something that I plan to make auto generated in the future builds giving people the option to add their own games and media. Like I say, WinVice is a brilliant emulator. This front end is purely to make it all a bit more pleasant to use. It launches straight into games, and then the games can be exited using the escape key. Most games work with the joystick set to port 2, but in the future I plan to read the game info and depending on the port setting for that game, set the port in the launch argument, making it so we always have a joystick in the right port for the game. This whole front end is a little thank you to show my appreciation to all my Patreons and is available on my Patreon now for download. On that note, if you would like to become a Patreon, get on over to my Patreon and join up. So that's why I've been quiet this last week, finishing this off. But now I'm back and I have a few videos planned and started. Let me know in the comments below what you think of this front end. It's early days and the grand scale of where I want to go with it, but I'm happy with it so far. Till next time, this is OSG, signing out.